Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of that celebrity interview. Good morning, Karen Moore and Ed Quinn. Welcome to the Founder BB Show to talk about BET, Tyler Perry's The Oval. My audience is very excited because they've told me they're avid watchers on Facebook and social media platforms. So what are you guys doing right out there, Karen, that these people love you so much? <laughs> All kind of crazy <laughs> stuff. <laughs> yeah, the, <laughs> the show is, 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 is crazy. And uh, like every, every episode, there's a cliffhanger. And so it's a really, really exciting show. When you say every episode is a cliffhanger, so that means it's, and can I say this word, kind of like a soap opera, you know, it goes off and it leads you to the next installment, that kind of crazy? Absolutely, absolutely. It's a primetime soap and it's escapism. And, you know, we left off last season with a decapitated girl in the president's bed. So <laughs> picking up Whoa. on one day, I think the audience, yeah, the audience, uh, I, I'm sure we'll be tuned in to see what happens from there. And tell me about your character, because we've seen you in so many things, and you embody each character when we see you, so now you're somewhere else. Yeah, no, it, I mean, it's such a, a fascinating role and a fascinating, mean, obviously, it's the President of the United States, but, you know, it's it's the President of the United States told through you know, Tyler Perry's lens, and so he's, uh, you know, just kind of this, Kind of this runaway train wreck. You can't quite get a a, a beat on 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 where his priorities lie, um, and it's just nonstop volatility. But also, you know, I try and bring a little bit of humor to him as well, which um, I think tends to resonate pretty well. When you're doing this role now, and the current administration or the current president that's in the White House, are there any similarities? No, I don't really think so, because you know. Hunter is more of a career politician. Um, you know, he was a, a mayor and then a governor and, you know, sort of more of this more, more establishment Washington. But, you know, Tyler's just always been fascinated about all, I mean, this this administration is, is incredibly volatile. But, you know, we've had volatile administrations going back. You know, uh, you know, you start thinking every decade there seems to be one that's um, that's uh, 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 pretty inflammatory. And. You know, it's it's so this is Tyler's just always been fascinated about what happens in the White House when the cameras aren't rolling, when the press corps is, you know, locked out, um, you know, which is why he wanted to tell it through that sort of um, upstairs, downstairs type of, uh, uh, of storytelling. All right, Karen, you're the first lady. Any similarities to any other first lady or you're just forging your own path? <laughs> I think Victoria Franklin is in a class all her own. Um, I'd say the, the only takeaway from any previous administration's uh, first ladies would be uh, probably her style, her fashion sense from maybe Jackie Owen, Michelle Obama. But other than that, she's, she's a whole different ball of wax. <laughs> <laughs> so does your role show uh, um, the role of the first lady behind the scenes? And I know this is behind the scenes, but we're always imagining, you know, the first lady saying, you shouldn't have said that, you shouldn't have done that, I don't want to do that, that kind of thing. She's very independent? Uh, yes, she is very independent, um, and she, she puts on a good face for the public, and this really, this show really does pull back the curtain on people's imaginations of what might be happening behind closed doors at the, at the White House. And in the case of the Franklin family, there's a lot of stuff going on. So it's, it's pretty Well, exciting. I'm sure everyone that has occupied that, that residence, there's a lot of stuff going on. Okay. And you, as I said earlier, we see you in so many things, you know, and you embody this character so good. Tell me the best part about playing this character. Well, I mean, I think it's the stature of it. I mean, you know, starting with, you know, Tyler built the actual White House. And, we, and, I, and you know, from the time I came out to first, you know, meet Tyler, um, there was just this big empty plot of dirt. And then the White House just grew. You know, I live on the studio um, when, I, when I come to work there. So I watched the entire White House get built. And, you know, also it's just, I love the fact that the cast is so huge and there's so many characters and so many intersecting storylines. 
because that really helps you thinks you know it gives you faith that we'll be doing this for a long long time um so yeah i i think it's just part being so iconic part being you know a part of the the tyler perry tapestry now and also the potential for a, a series that's going to run for a long long time I believe it's going to run for a long, long time because my audience was elated to have an opportunity to hear you two speak. Kiran, when do you guys want us to watch the uh, by Tyler Perry's The Oval? Uh, I'm sorry, could you repeat? When do you want us to watch you on The Oval? Oh, oh yes. Well, the second half of season one comes back Wednesday, uh, 9, 8 central on BET. And you can catch up on all 12 of the first half of the season on BET Plus streaming right now. I'm going to do that this weekend and give me something to binge watch. I want to thank you guys for talking about The Oval, and I know you're going to get another season, so please come back to the Valder BB Show. It's been my pleasure. Thank you, Thank you, you so much. It's been a pleasure. Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB Show broadcast on radio and television, and this is My Phone Pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. I have used Credit Help USA, the credit restoration company that's bonded and state certified. When you become a client of Credit Help USA, you become eligible for a set of stainless steel cookware from Credit Help USA and the Valder BB Show. Get your credit straight today. Visit credithelptx.com, click on the Valder BB Show icon, and get started living life divinely. <music>